Okay, we're at the Abbott Downing Elementary School. You can see from the outside, we have some unique fe features to this building as well. Up on that very top, that square, we're going to be placing in the next couple of months the old cupola that came from the original Conant School. It's been in the process of being refurbished. We've redone a lot of the copper on there. We have a nice weather vane of the Abbott Downing uh, car, coach car, that's going to sit atop it. And we're going we're gonna to do a nice little ceremony and put that on top before the school building is actually opened. So again, in the next several months. Some of the other unique features, this red portion is the main entry, but it's a more formal entry. We did it in the model of the old red schoolhouse. It was just a nice little theme that we wanted to put towards the building. This has a very classic look, as you'll see. We have metal panels, so silver metal panels going around those white uh, windows and the nice brick you see right there. Those little bump outs are shared between each classroom on the second floor where those metal panels pop out. And if you follow along, we'll go right straight into the building. This is the administrative wing, which I'll take you in. But if you turn around, you'll see these nice high ceilings and again, a lot of available glass letting uh, light in. This is the east elevation, so we're gonna get all the morning sunlight right in through this glass wall right here. In here is the main reception area. So we'll have the secretaries sitting here. They'll have full view of looking outside, seeing parents and teachers coming in this door. But they'll also have full view, and I'll show you where the buses are going to pick up and drop off right down the hallway. So this, this location is situated perfectly for that. They'll have buzzer systems like we'll have in the other schools too. So after school starts, they'll be able to visually see um, through cameras back to this, to this desk here who's at the front door to allow them in. If you walk through here, we'll take you through the principal's office and the nurse's station main mailbox area right here for all the teachers to collect their stuff. There'll be uh, copiers right in this location. Right now we're in a conference room for the administrators. We'll have a nice long table here. We have power coming out of the floor right here. We're also going to have Eno board sitting right on the, on the uh, wall here. And it allows for a lot of uh, teacher interface with each other, training, training on the Eno board. This is a collaboration space for all the teachers. It was very, very uh, much wanted. We didn't have as much of that in the other schools. So we had the opportunity to build this into these schools, and that's what we've done. You can see we've taken advantage of the high ceilings and the, a lot more natural light coming in. We have uh, duct work here, as we th do throughout the building. We have uh, an HVAC system, which is capable of four times air exchange per hour in um, all these buildings. So what's nice is there's a replenishment of uh, fresh conditioned air every 15 minutes. So we have that built throughout. In through this door right here is the principal's office. For durability of the, 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 uh, the building, we took, um, we're using maple, solid maple for the window sills. You can see these are being installed. Very, very durable. It's a, it's a New England product. And um, it's also manufactured here in New England, in, uh, just outside of Bow, New Hampshire. Again, principal's office. And as you walk through here, I'll show you into the nurse's space. Hi. In here is a nurse's office. We'll also have a bathroom. They'll have availability for beds to be in here for, for sick children. We also have a uh, ADA accessible shower in here as well. So we have all we can we can service all the needs should any kids come uh, become sick during the day. We're outside of the Abbott Downing School. This is going to be the collection area where all the kids get dropped off and picked up at the end of the day or obviously in the beginning of the day. Abbott Downing is named after the Abbott Downing Car Company and we, we wanted to create a theme for this particular school. So the theme is transportation. And behind me you can see the stoplight colors. Those are the bump outs for the kindergarten area. Again, we, we felt it was a very playful thing with the kids. It was very enjoyable for the kids to, 
to see the stoplights and, and also know that it's a transportation theme and that it's named after the Abbott Downing Car Company. As you can see, and in fact I'd like to point out, these areas of uh, various color gray and white panels, vertical panels and the big louvers, inside of those rooms are uh, all of the HVAC mechanical equipment. Very, very early on in design, we worked with the engineers and we wanted to encapsulate all of that equipment inside the building. It extends the life of it, it's easy to maintain year round, and it also muffles the sound so that in these communities, they're not hearing uh, HVAC you know, noises coming from there because they're all muffled. So you'll see this on all three of the schools, but I just wanted to point it out. This was a good shot for it. Again, here's a covered canopy entry, so the kids will have this area to be dropped off in, mill around. Buses will come in right off the corner, as well as uh, you know, cars dropping kids off. We're going to be uh, tearing down the old Conan School after school gets out this year to make way for all the play area and also the drive through for uh, pickup and drop-offs. Here's the stage area. As you can see, we've got four skylights with some other lights um, allowing a ton of natural light in this area. Over in this direction here is a kitchen, which we can take you through and show you. Part of the unique parts of the stage here, and it's unique to all of the schools, is this area is built out in a persimium right here so it's nice steps coming up you can access the stage this way or you could actually have a musical performance where people could be sitting on the stage projecting out to the uh, to the audience but over here we have some uh, food service office right behind you and a uh, dishwashing area right through that doorway right here you can see the uh, stainless Steel hoods are already in place, and it's just awaiting for the floor to get put down with tile. And then after that, we'll put in the uh, gas range and stoves. There'll be a serving line right here with serving trays, and all the kids will be able to come in and access their lunch from this window and eat right out here into the cafeteria. All right, so we're getting ready to wrap up this tour of the Abbott Downing School again. Over my shoulder, you can see the entrance area. What we're standing on, too, I might add, is all uh, pervious materials that are going to be put in in the spring. Again, it allows for good drainage, and all of these buildings are built to CHIPS standards. That's collaboration of high-performing schools. Very, very similar to LEED. These are uh, very, very green, sustainable buildings, and I mention that because this pervious surface that we're going to be putting down also helps us uh, with that green technology.